Hey, welcome back to Jazz Time. Jazztime.com is an online store that buys, sells, and trades authentic luxury watches. We make these videos so you can easily choose the best watch for yourself in the comfort of your own home. We offer the lowest prices anywhere online. If you'd like to know the price, simply click on the links in the description below. We'd greatly appreciate if you'd purchase your next watch from us at jazztime.com. Today we'll be taking a look at a Richard Mille, this one, the RM29. Uh, basically, the main feature of this one is the oversized date as you can see the minute hand just before that uh, the date at the four o'clock indicator there again rm29 that's the model number here really really simple i like richard mule they keep things relatively simple in that aspect but otherwise it's a pretty complicated timepiece so i'll be going over all the aspects of this watch case bezel dial crown functions the movement as well as the strap here and i'll be giving my thoughts on these throughout this video so starting off with the case we have the tonneau shaped case titanium or uh, i believe this is all titanium yes and you can tell by the size of the case because uh, basically that is basically the essential body the bezel is the entire front portion here when you when you're looking at a face on that's all you see bezel uh, the sapphire crystal and of course the dial and the movement within so the bezel matches the casing here this is all titanium all with their own proprietary screws here uh, dimensions measuring 48 millimeters by 39 or 48 millimeters tall 39.7 millimeters uh, by 12.6 millimeters thick so not the dressiest watch uh, in terms of you know being able to slide under a suit cuff but it will fit basically pretty much everything else because well richard mill Mil they sort of fit within the sort of motorsports and other uh you know sporty type of nature all right, altogether, the power reserve for this watch about 50, 55 hours. The oversized date display, uh, kind of special for this model. That's sort of what this model is made for. Uh, has that semi instantaneous uh, date feature there. Um, I'll be going over that in a moment, but taking a look here at the crystal itself it measures or it, it fits within the dimensions and fits the curvature of the front of the case sort of like that outward curvature very signature of richard mill the dial itself skeletonized and gives you the model reference number rm29 right there at the nine o'clock position in yellow at the four o'clock we have the oversized date with sort of like a reddish outline at least on the top and bottom with the seconds hand red tipped matching red as you can see and a little bit of luminescence so if i turn out the lights here you basically get the index marks for the dial as well as the minute and hour hand tips and that sweeping seconds and my camera's having a tough time focusing here but there we go we have the luminescence there so you can basically tell the time still in low light situations let's turn the lights back on here all right, now taking a look at the crown functions, just wind the watch at the base position for that crown. Uh, no need to move it any other way. And you have a good 55 hour, hours of power reserve, so that's about two and a half days. You're good there. Pull the crown out to the next position. You can advance the date forward. Actually, you can pull the crown out to the final position, move that minute hand out of the way, stop that second hand so you can set the time nice and precise. But taking a look at how the date function here works, it's as you would expect. However, the days in the tens and ones column are actually slightly different. They function separately. So they're not one date wheel, but two in one in that aperture. And I like how the date sort of resets after the 31st back to the first. So it's about a half turn to advance it by one. And there you go. It moves <laughs> just that, that tens position forward and keeps the one there so very very good complication there from richard meal all right and again if you pull the crown out to the final position you have the hacking seconds function so you can set the time nice and precise very very good from now now let me refer to my notes here on what the caliber is it's the automatic caliber rm29 i believe that just basically fits the name of the watch here well, because it's for that specific purpose of the oversized date, it has to accommodate that large date wheel or two large date wheels put together. It features a double barrel system. So basically you have a, a very even uh, winding and unwinding of the watch full with that uh, winding rotor as well. Spline screws in grade five titanium for all those bridges, the base plate, uh, bridges and the balance 
all made of titanium so it keeps it very light and incredibly strong and resilient the movement itself 30.25 millimeters by 28.5 millimeters 28.45 millimeters 5.83 millimeters thick 32 joules with a glue suitor balance wheel with four arms inertia movement and 4.8 milligrams centimeters squared angle of lift 53 degrees so if you're a nerd uh, more of a nerd than I am that'll probably make sense to you frequency beats added at, fr at uh, 28 28,800 vibrations per hour or 4 hertz that means it moves eight times per second you have the Elinvar balance spring and the Rubyfix escapement wheel jewels so basically it lasts for freaking forever uh, that's basically what RM is known for they're just they make things that will last forever and this particular model came from 2012, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. So, you know, certainly a 10 year old watch still running as clean as the day it left the dealership. All right now, taking a look here at the, uh, the strap here, the rubber strap, incredibly soft and still pliant, incredibly smooth as well. You have the channels there for uh, venting the wrist as well as sizing holes for the sizing pin on that uh, the clasp or the pin buckle here sort of like a pin buckle double deployment system here all titanium as well nice set and brush finish on that clasp with the full Richard Mille wordmark logo and the way that it works here is that it basically just bends the metal there and the natural position of that metal keeps it nice and shut so trying it on my wrist once more seven inches is my wrist size Okay, so I have this a little bit big for me. Well, and that's basically what you get with Richard Meal. Nice and big, goes all the way across the wrist, wraps around as well. The channels for that, the strap there basically uh, hug the wrist very nicely and they vent it very easily. So you can wear this all day, every day. No worries about having it, you know, basically turn into a tourniquet and, you know, leaving you with a completely sweaty arm afterwards. It's very comfortable indeed on the wrist. Feels very good and it's so incredibly light. It feels like I'm not wearing anything at all. Feels like I'm wearing nothing at all. And uh, the way that it looks on the wrist, very practical and incredibly usable. Something that you can wear every day because you know you have the titanium, you have the rubber, everything here is lasting for a very long time. And with a very, very easy to read Arabic numeral system with the index marks going all the way across, all the way around this dial, that large date window, what's not to love about this? A very practical and very usable and distinctive Richard Mille RM29. So let us know what you think about this watch down in the comments below. Be sure to like this video, hit the subscribe button, be sure to hit the bell notification so you can be notified when we go live with another video like this one. As always, if you'd like to purchase this watch, or any other watch, new, used, discontinued, we can get it for you here at Jazz Time. Click the link in the description below to get it at the lowest possible price anywhere online. Thanks for watching. Take care. We'll see you in the next video. If you want to find out more about the watch you just saw in the video, you can just click below on Show More to see the full description. Then you can check the link next to Model as Seen in Video. Click on it and you will get to the proper page where you can see all the details. If you're watching on a mobile phone, you have to click on the arrow down on the right hand side below the video to see the full description. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you would like to share this video with your friends, you can use the share button below and share it on any platform you like. If you have questions, constructive feedback, want to tell us about some mistakes or misspeaks, just write a comment below. If you want to see more videos like this, you should subscribe to our channel and visit our channel page where you can find all the videos. And if you're interested in a specific watch brand, you can check out our playlists. If you want to check the price for a watch or want to buy one, remember at jazztime.com you always get a steep discount. So you should check the prices with us. If you want to know the price for a specific watch, just go to Google, type in Jazz Time, plus the brand, model, and the details you're interested in, and Google will find the right page for you. Thank you for watching.